When it comes to sales training and ramping up sales hires, one of the most time consuming and challenging pieces is getting reps comfortable with the demo process. The reason for that is if we're in the software world, an account executive or a sales engineer, they're trying to learn all of the unique facets and use cases for their prospective customers to use their tool. Couple that with the fact that there's tends to be a lot of technical knowledge that goes into a software tool, all the modules and how things could be applied, tweaked, all the settings behind the scenes. It can be a whole bunch of information for that rep to understand. Therefore, it can take them 50 to 100 reps of going through practice demos before they can feel comfortable jumping in front of a real customer. That process is very painful, and we don't really have a way to scale that up in a normal environment. If you're just giving your rep something like a, a recorded Zoom call of previous demos, or maybe just some samples to go off of, it can be helpful, but you're still relying on the account executive or the sales rep to remember everything in their head and hopefully get all of those pieces presented to the customer. So one of the unique ways we've seen uh, sales enablement teams to, to really highlight uh, what they can do to ramp up those reps faster is to use an IORAD tutorial, not necessarily in a customer facing way, but actually internally as sort of a tour guide or uh, some cheat sheets, if you will, for the account executive or the sales rep going through the demo. So we'll go through an example here. So let's just say for a fictitious example that I'm an account executive and I'm selling Google Sites as my product, just for an easy thing to understand. Instead of that rep having to go sit down on a Zoom call with that first customer, open up their Google Sites and try to recall that entire script from memory or make sure that they don't miss anything, what the reps have been able to leverage now using IORAD being that they're single sign-on, when they start up a demo conversation, they can just click on the extension and they can just pull up the tool that we have marked as demo in this sample environment. So I have Google Sites demo. And when I click on this, I can choose from the different modes. So I'm gonna show the do it mode here, which is actually live functionality. And what you're gonna notice when I hit go live, we actually disabled all of the voiceover and any of the other screens. So right now, all it is, is just a, basically a section on the screen that's coming live in app for them. You can also do this the try it mode where it's just a, a screen uh, sort of simulation. And we have this little talk track down the bottom that guides. You have some configurability in IORAD on how you set this up. But the idea is this, how can we give our reps a little cheat sheet so they know where to click next and maybe a couple of bullets on what they should be saying at this point in the, in the demonstration. So now they can just click through here and you'll see they'll be guided on where to click next and they'll even be told what they should be saying at those different stages. So it opens up this next step and it shows them, you know, this is the Google Sites homepage. From this view, you can see all the available Google Sites templates. This includes those that your organization has made available to you, as well as the standard defaulted templates from Google. So you could configure that any way you want and it allows the rep to add in their own little flavor and personality, but still give them the bulleted action items that need to be demonstrated on that demo. And it just allows them to kind of guide through this demo without having to feel like they're recalling everything from memory. They have this little cheat sheet. It shows kind of professionalism and make sure that the, the flow is there, the right cadence is being put forth, and it can be a huge time saver in ramping because they're not relying on repetition. They have this guide kind of like a GPS that's guiding them through what to do next, where to click next, and even what to say. So it can be a unique way to give your reps a little bit of added support uh, when they're brand new and trying to learn this kind of drinking through a fire hose. And secondly, if you ever add any features in the future, you can just alter and adjust that demo so that when they get to that stage of the demo and they need to showcase that new module, they'll have a guide that's gonna highlight where to click on the screen and then just a couple of uh, key pieces of information to be able to demonstrate.